Did you know that Grok AI is now free and unlimited? Yes, you can now generate images and videos for free using Grok, just like me. And it's watermark free. Over to you, Jay. Show them how to use Grok AI properly. All right, so welcome to my phone. My name is Jean Francis J for short. In this video, I'm going to guide you on how to use Grok AI properly to avoid this. BS time. You're not getting your brown ring yard. Like with the start line, I brown back. And achieve this. Yes, you can now generate images and videos for free using Grok, just like me. Now, the first thing that we need to do is to go to Play Store and search for Grok AI. Search for Grok AI. Once you search for Grok AI, you are going to see this particular AI. Mine is showing updates, so yours is going to show download. Download it to your phone. Once you have downloaded it to your phone, open the app. Now, once you open the Grok AI, it's going to bring you to this interface. You're going to see create video. Let me show you guys. You're going to see create video, open camera, voice mode, and edit video. Now, I'm going to show you how to use Grok AI. I'm going to start from image, how to generate image with Grok AI, and also how to use it and create amazing videos. Now, to generate images, just click at this top here. Yeah? You're going to see imagine. Just click on that imagine. Now, it's going to bring you to this interface. This is where you enter the prompt for the image that you want to generate. So, I have a prompt already of an image that I want to generate. So, I'm just going to copy that prompt now and paste it here. Go to my notebook and copy the prompt. So, this is the prompt. I'll copy the prompt now. Copy. And we go back to Grok AI. Now, I'm going to paste it here. And we hit on send. Now, it's going to generate different images according to our prompts. You can see it. You can see different, a lot of images. So, now I want to use this particular one. This is the one that I want to use. So, I'm just going to click here to download the image to my phone. And it doesn't have any watermark. Now, if you notice, you're going to see that this image is in 9 by 16 aspect ratio, which that you cannot change the aspect ratio on this Grok app. This is how to change the aspect ratio to your desired aspect ratio. Let's say I want to change this image from 9 by 16 to 16 by 9 aspect ratio. What I'm going to do is to go to this app. This is called uh, Gemini. I believe if you are a lover of AI, you are going to have this app on your phone. If you don't have the app on your phone, just go to Play Store and download the Gemini. Or you can open your Chrome, you can open your browser and search for Google AI Studio. Once you search for Google AI Studio, open Nano Banana and you continue with the step I'm about to mention right now. So now, once you open Gemini, add that image that we saved from Grok AI. Now, I'm adding the image that we got from Grok AI. Now, I want to convert this image from 9 by 16 to 16 by 9, which is YouTube aspect ratio. What I'm going to do now is to add an image that has the aspect ratio that I want to convert to. So let me add an image that is 16 by 9. So now I've added the image that is 16 by 9 aspect ratio. What, what I'm going to do is to go below and type regenerate the first image using the aspect ratio of the second image. Now, I'll hit on send. Now, it's going to regenerate that first image. That image that we got from Grok AI is going to regenerate it to 16 by 9 ratio, which is the YouTube ratio. So, let's wait. Alright, so it has regenerated the image from 9 by 16 to 16 by 9. You can see the image here. So, I'm just going to download this image now. And then we go back to Grok AI, where the magic happens. Now, to create our video, just click here and add the image that you want to turn to video. So, I'm just going to add that one that I got from Gemini. Now, it's going to automatically turn this image to video. 
this man is working now it's going to animate that image working so let's wait and see for the result all right so grok ai has generated the video and if you watch closely you can see that the man is working on the video that is he generated the video based on the action that is being performed on the image i uploaded which is the man is working now assuming that i don't want this man to be working alone i want this man to perform another action this is what i'm going to do first of all i had to mute the audio so that you can be able to hear me now what i'm going to do is to click here click at this arrow here once you click on this arrow it's going to pull up this option for you you are going to see custom speech fun and normal now click on custom once you click on custom this is where you enter a test prompt that is a test form that is going to guide grok ai on what to do on the video now let's say i don't want this man to work alone like i want him to work and then turn around what i'm going to do first of all let me copy the prompts that i prepared for this video that is the prompt i got from ChatGPT for this animation let me copy the prompt from my notebook so this is the prompt i'm going to copy the prompt now and go back to grok ai and on grok ai i'm going to first of all let me mute this i'm going to paste the prompt and then we hit on send now grok ai is going to regenerate that video based on the prompts based on the instructions that i gave it that is to make the man walk and turn around let's wait and see the result all right so grok ai has regenerated the video according to my instruction that is the man will walk and then turn around you can see that the man is now performing another action now i want this man to be walking and saying something what i'm going to do is to simply click here let me show you guys click on that same arrow once you click on that arrow sorry i had to mute the audio so that you'll be able to hear me once you click on the arrow you are going to see speech you're going to see speech let me show you guys you're going to see speech then click on that speech now i already have a prompt i went to chat gpt and i told chat gpt to give me a prompt to animate a man walking then while walking he's saying life is simple we rise by lifting others then chat gpt gave me a prompt now let me copy that prompt from my notes so this is the prompt i'm just going to copy the prompt copy then we go back to grok ai now on grok ai i'm going to select this now on grok AI, i'm going to select speech now we're about to animate we're not just animating we want to make the image to say what we want it to say so i'm just going to paste this prompt here now and we hit on send let's see what we have just go to chat gpt get your prompt tell chat gpt that you want to animate an image that image is going to be performing certain action then while performing that action that image is saying something get the prompt come to grok ai select speech and paste it exactly that way you got it from ChatGPT. Now let's wait for the result and see what we have. Life is simple. We rise by lifting others. Life is simple. We rise by lifting others. All right, so you can see what we have. You can see how he's saying life is simple. We rise by lifting others. Now this is how to use Grog AI. I had to prompt it to walk naturally and wave like have natural hand gestures while he says life is simple we rise by lifting others this is just how easy and simple it is to use grok ai now if you are getting value from this video don't forget to give us a thumbs up share with your family and friends don't be stingy now share now to download your video is very simple just click here you're going to see an arrow here Click on the arrow and this video 
is going to be downloaded straight to your phone no watermark nothing just a high quality video now this brings us to the end of this video if you have any questions just feel free to drop it in the comment section and i'll make sure to reply to your question see you guys on my next video peace out